it has been way too long. I kind of fell out of my normal filming and uploading schedule when I was kind of adjusting to a new life at school. And I also fell into a big reading slump, so I was not really reading a lot. And I didn't really have that much to post anyways. But I'm home for winter break and I've been reading so much. So I thought I would just do like a reading vlog. You know, get back into filming and just show you what I've been reading and stuff and take you along for the week. So I'll just go over my reading plans right now. For this week, I am currently reading two books. So the first one is... The Wicked King by Holly Black. I read The Cruel Prince over the summer and I enjoyed it. So now I'm picking up this one. I'm 29 pages in and I'm liking it so far. So I'm definitely trying to finish like more series by the end of 2023. I don't know if that's, I don't know if I'm gonna finish this whole trilogy, but like at least make a little bit more progress would be good. And then have my Kindle here, I'm reading the Hollow Boy by Jonathan Stroud, which is the third book in the Lockwood & Co. series. I'm 19% done and I'm on page 74. I'm really enjoying it as well. I love this series so much. So again, trying to like get through another series. So I'll at least have these two books and then like I'm not sure what other books I want to read. I have... So I saw this movie on Monday and I loved it and so I'm really debating rereading this because why not? I have the time so I think I might pick this one up, reread it, and I am excited. So I think I'll try to reread this maybe. I don't know if I'll prioritize this. That's my little update. I have this huge stack of books here. Like I went got books to the library. I don't know if I'm gonna read all of them. Or you know I could just reread the Hunger Games. That's always an option. So I'm not really sure what exactly what books I'm going to read this week, but I know I'm going to finish these two and maybe I'll like, maybe my hold for a queen of nothing will come in and then I can like finish that whole trilogy. I would love that. So yeah, that's my little update. And yeah, I will come back later with a little update. Okay. Okay, wait, I forgot to say that it is Wednesday. It is 10.32 on Wednesday morning. So I'm probably just going to film for like the whole week or yeah and i will get a lot of reading done today probably made much progress on the wicked king i'm on page 47 so i've like barely read 20 pages but my hold for the queen of death came in so now i'm gonna be trying to just finish this trilogy in this video i think it's definitely doable even though like it's taking me a long time to read this book i don't know why I, I i'm just like a slow reader and i've made a little bit more progress on the hollow boy i'm like page 75 or something so actually is not it's literally no progress i think it's five pages but yeah that's my update hello everyone it is friday morning i think yesterday i said it was wednesday and it was just not it was thursday yesterday but today it is friday morning and i have made quite some progress on the wicked king i got it on my kindle because it was available on libby so i was like i'll just borrow it so i could read it at night when i like turn off all my lights you know because I like that. I like just reading it in the dark in my room. That's like really fun. Okay, I'm on page 127. So that means I have less than 200 pages left because I think there's 332 pages in this book. So that means that I have less than 200 pages left, which I think is definitely doable for today. Like my goal is to finish this today. I think it's definitely doable. And in The Hollow Boy, I've not made much progress. I think I'm just prioritizing this book. I think I'm just gonna try to finish this. I'm like really into it. Like The Cruel Prince, I remember I liked book two a lot better than book one, but here like I'm so captivated. I'm so immersed in the story. Yeah, I'm really into it. Like there's been a lot of, I wouldn't say like action, but like a lot has happened 
and I'm truly interested in the story. So yeah, that's my little update and I will come back later with another one. Saturday and I have like 35 pages left so I'm gonna finish this tonight but I am so stressed right now I'm so stressed like I oh my god I actually cannot stop reading I'm like this book is so wild okay I need to go finish it now but I just want to give that update because I'm actually so stressed about what is happening I'm gonna finish Yay. okay I just finished it is 12 47 and what just happened? What just happened? I don't even know what to say, but I just finished and like literally immediately tomorrow, as soon as I wake up, I'll be starting Queen of Nothing because what was that ending? <laughs> oh my God. Okay. And maybe I'll start it tonight. I will just update in the morning with my like, this is definitely five stars. Okay. Good night. <laughs> it is one o'clock. Let's see how much I can read before I fall asleep. Hey everyone. It's been like two days since I filmed an update, like actually sat down here and filmed an update because I was in my bed like filming, but that's not the same. So I have huge update as you heard last night. I finished The Wicked King, five out of five stars, so good. I loved it a lot. I think maybe the reason I didn't like The Cruel Prince as much as I liked this book is because I feel like I was able to f have more of a connection to the characters like, I loved Jude so much in this book. I love her. So I started The Queen of Nothing last night, and I'm already, like, pretty far in. I think I'm, like, 20% in. I'm on page 53, and I'm, like, loving it. I'm so happy with it. But, yeah. I don't know if we'll do that much reading tonight because it's Christmas Eve, and we're having, like, our friends over. So I don't know if I'll read that much. I mean like tonight I'll probably end up staying up really late and reading but yeah that's my little update and I hope that everyone's just having a good day and yeah I will talk to you later okay hello everyone so it is Christmas morning and I just wanted to say I don't have my kindle up here with me currently but I'm like 30% done of the queen of nothing I'm loving it I had one of my like absolute favorite tropes in it last night and I actually got up and had to like run through the house after I read it because I was like there's no way that, that just happened. I'm just enjoying the series so much. I think it's been a while since I was this immersed in the series. Because I think the last time I've really been this immersed was The Infernal Devices. And we all know how I feel about that series. That's my little update. And I will talk to you guys later. Hello everyone. It is Tuesday. And I have come on here to say that I finished The Queen of Nothing. It was 5 out of 5 stars. I loved it. It had like the same amount of action as The Wicked King did. I was really into that and I love the characters. I love Cardin and Jude. I love Vivi. Those were like my favorites. Jude, like probably one of my favorite main characters ever. I love her so much. So I thought I would just go through, you know, my reading for the, these past, I think it's been six days. And I'm also here to end this vlog as well. But I thought I would just go over what I've read. So first I finished the Wicked King, five out of five stars, loved it. It was so good. And if you haven't picked up the series, I would definitely recommend it. And this is definitely probably one of my favorite series now. Like definitely up there with my favorite series. And then for Lockwood and Co, The Hollow Boy, I was reading that on like Thursday and Friday. 
I kind of stopped reading that. I think I'm just going to pick it up like another time. I think it's just not really the right time for me to be reading it. I'm not that into it. And since I love like the characters, I'd rather come back to another time when I'm like more in the mood to read it. But on my Kindle, I did just get The Do-Over by Lynn Painter. So I think I'm going to read that next. That's it for my vlog. I hope that you guys enjoyed and it's good to be back filming. But yeah, this is a little bit of a chaotic video. I feel like it was kind of random, but I enjoyed filming. So I hope that you enjoyed and thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!